Hi, magical, beautiful people. Thank you for joining me back for part two of my rant. And um, I just want to go back into my story. So anyway, it was my father's birthday on Monday. And um, I went and, you know, I said, hey, let me check my blood sugar level because I went to him and you know he was like all right whatever um my glasses broke that morning and so that's why I also went to him he fixed my glasses and then we went and I got um my blood sugar level tested that whole morning I didn't have no food all I had was that cherry juice that I talked about in the last video how I love it from BJ's and it was not watered down it was pure cherry juice and I had about like a 42 ounce cup of it and I've had two of those cups since the morning and I was just non-stop sugar for about a week so anyway my father goes and he's like okay let me test your blood sugar so first he pricks me and nothing really comes out and he's like wow your skin is so thick and he's squeezing, 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 and little, little, uh, enough blood comes out. So he checks it. And when he checks it, he's like, he looks at me and he's like, no, this can't, this can't be true. This can't be true. Oh, I'm, I'm going to do it again. Go wash your hands and I'm going to go do it again. And I said, what, what is it? He's like, just go wash your hands and I'm going to go do it again. So he went and he said, you know what, I'm not even going to use this one. I'm going to prick you again. Let's take another um, sample, whatever. He did it again and he said, Vanessa, this cannot be true. This cannot be true right now. And I said, what, what is going on? So now I'm knowing something is a little wrong. And he's like, look, look, tell me, tell me this is not, this is not true. And he said, you know what, you know, don't look. I'm going to go wash your hands again. I'm going to prick you one more time. We're going to see this. And he goes and he pricks me one more time. And he's like, I'm not even going to look. I'm going to walk away. You look at it and tell me this is not true. So I look at it and it was ridiculous. It was a ridiculous number. So if you guys don't know what blood sugar level is, normal people usually have a blood sugar level between 90 and 120, I want to say. 90 and 120 is a good range. After 120 to 170, it's pre-diabetic range and 170 and up is diabetic range. So my blood sugar level when he first pricked me was 500 and 34 that is way above 170 way above and I was shocked I was like I cannot believe that was my blood sugar level when he pricked me uh, when he did it the second time it actually went down so I was relieved about it but it was still fucking high it went from 534 to 461 and that is still way in diabetic range then he went and he pricked me again and the third time that's when I looked at it um and the reason why I know the two numbers is because you have the storage so he told me to look at the past two ones so that was it but um the last time that's when I looked at it it was 460 so I was so shocked I was so scared I was so like overwhelmed I had so much anxiety I said oh my god I cannot have diabetes I am not even 23 I cannot have diabetes right now I cannot do that I cannot do this to myself I cannot do that to my body I don't have kids I cannot do that to my husband how am I gonna live what is going on what like you know all this thing what flushing through my head and I was so scared, I was so sad, I was so worried and everything and he said this cannot happen, what is going on, you need to, you know what, he said go home, I'm going to give you my, um, my stuff and I am going to make you, um, you check your um, blood sugar level in the morning, do not eat after 8 o'clock 
and um and then check it in the morning when you wake up to see what your blood sugar level was so i was really 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 worried and scared and so upset i came home right away and i took it again and when i took it again it went from 460 to 456 and that was really 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 disappointing to me i said it, t it takes me about 30 minutes to come from my parents house to my house so I was like, it should have went down. It went down from 534 to 4, uh, 460 or 461. So it should have went down even more, but it did not. So I said, you know what? I'm not going to look at it again. I am just going to, um, I'm just going to go and, uh, what do you call it? Just fast. So I tried to fast. And I was so hungry because again, all I had was the two cups of the juice, the 42 ounces um, of juices. So that would be 84 ounces, 84 ounces of juice that whole day. So I was so hungry. So I said, oh my God, you know what? I'm going to have some grilled chicken because my husband has some grilled chicken uh, nuggets from BJ's that we got in there. I said, I'm going to cook that up with some um, sweet peppers and I'm going to have a little bit of mashed potatoes and that's it. Um, I ended up finishing the juice that I had in my container and I had a um, little bit of soda. That's it. And I did it and I took my blood sugar later that night um, and it was from 456 to 4, 449. So it's going down, but it's not going down fast enough for me. And I'm so freaking scared that I just don't know what to do um but I think this is actually going to be a part three video so I will see you in the next part thank you for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed this video stay tuned for part three